Welcome to episode 4 of the No Money Spent series. We are here, guys. We are here. We opened our one coin pack at a 71 overall Mike Boone. But it doesn't look like the cards are quite out yet. Probably they're trying to make sure that there's no glitches. None of the cards are in the catalog either. But something that we have not gotten over is the Team Builder promo. Now, there are some cards that looks very good, like this Sam Laporta right here. We can afford all these cards. I'm not going to buy them right now. As you see, Sam Laporta, 85 speed, 85 catching. Absolutely insane card. And then the also, also the other card that is very, very good is Asante Samuel Jr. 85 speed, 85, 87 excel, 87 agility. Great coverage stats. So, two of the best cards in the game right there and then you also have baker mayfield joe mixon who's 189k makes sense and then deron Payne. we have jalen phillips who's also really good jack conklin a good right tackle and then cooper cup very very good and then yeah that's about it for that promo and one thing we did we might have just gotten the best free card in the entire game we have gotten 82 overall divine diablo he's in the thumbnail He's in the team. He's on the team, I should say. He's 86 speed at middle linebacker. Remember, Chris Johnson, one of the fastest players of all time in this game, is 87 speed. And Divine Diablo here is 86. He has 88 excel. And then you might think that's it. No, he has 85 tackling and 85 hit power. Oh my goodness. He also has 83 jumping. Which, if you don't know, that's very, very good for a middle linebacker. He has done so well for me. 75 change of direction. Dude, this card is so good. And this is how I got him. It's super simple. This is how I got him. All you have to do is you have to go to the team builder solos. Of course, I'm almost done with them. Then you have to just get these two challenges done right here. Uh, make sure you get the five stars. And then you get Divine Diablo. It's that easy. This is what you get from the Team Builder Solos. You get an 82 overall BND Team Builders Player Fantasy Pack. That's how you get the Divine Diablo. Make sure you go to Divine Diablo. Please make sure you go with Divine Diablo. Such a good card. Uh, one of the best free cards in the game. May be the best free card in the game. We have a Najee Harris coming out in Season Boom promo. He's not going to be the best free card in the game. And then there's a Christian Watson leaked. I don't know if that's going to be like someone in the Solos. Uh, but it's going to be very interesting. I think he has like 85, 84 speed. So he's definitely going to be a wide receiver two. Uh, sorry, wide receiver three. We already had Heinz Ward and Mike Evans. Uh, but yeah, team, Solar, team Builder Souls are very, very, very good. And look, as you see here, the ultimate of boom. Uh, oh, wow. Look at this. Okay. It won't let us in. So it looks like everything's out. But there are new challenges, I think, maybe. Okay. So the show's new things. And did it add challenges? I think it did. So I'm going to end up getting these challenges done. But let's go over the Season of Boom promo first. So we're supposed to get a Puka Nakua. I don't know if that's coming out right now. Maybe it'll come out later. We have a Boom Opportunity Pack. All right. So, you know, we don't spend money. So that doesn't matter for us. Oh, we have a Platinum Player. Is this going to be glitched? Is this going to be glitched, guys? Imagine if it is. That'd be insane. And of course, it's just a 79 overall, so just quick sell it. Is it glitched? No, it is not. That sucks. The baby boom bundle. What is this? The 80 plus, the 80 plus. Wow, voice crack. Oh, we already have a voice crack, and the video just started. This is not good. And we also have boom fantasy packs. This is new. Odds look absolutely terrible. Do not do not open those packs. And something. Oh, wow. Our pro ace fantasy packs are in the game now. They added these in the game. They're a special offer, which we opened, and we made a little bit of coins. Looks like they didn't do anything with training. Of course, yesterday they brought out the mystery packs. I opened a couple. They're not too great, but if you get a core elite pack, you make coins and make training. So that's pretty good. Pro Ace Fantasy Bundle, looking pretty good. Uh, 12,000 points, though. If it was 8,900, it would probably be worth it. I don't know if you have to do a set for Puka. Could be wrong. I think you just get them. Uh, but these are the players that have came out. We have six champs. Jeffrey Simmons, Richard Sherman, Jalen Petre, CJ Ham, Graham Glasgow, 
and my guy Brandon Ayuk who's about to get traded or stay. I, he's if he if he doesn't get traded, it'll be a huge shock. Uh, so Graham Glasgow probably good left guard. Brandon Ayuk, you know he's always has good cards. Jalen Petre looks good. Uh, of course Richard Sherman, he's always gonna be a good card. C.J. Ham not worth it with that Mike Tolbert. And then uh, Jeffrey Simmons. You have the Max Crosby. You have the Miles Garrett. So probably not worth it. So the three cards you probably want. Or four, I guess. Richard Sherman, Jalen Petra, and Graham Glasgow. So I'm going to get to you guys once I finish the challenges up right here. And then hopefully we'll have a, our Puka Nakua by then. I could, I, I think I think we get him today. Because rookie premieres come today. Which means our... I, I didn't do rookie premieres. I accidentally screwed up and did not get it in time. Oh, wow. You see this? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. So, mystery packs are gone in a, in a day and 20 hours. I'm guessing that's just, like, upgrade the odds, maybe? I could be wrong. I'll get to you guys once I finish the challenges, and hopefully we'll have our Puka Nakua. As I'm recording this right now, still have not gotten the Puka Nakua. I just finished a head-to-head -head rank game. There's 18 seconds left. I was inside the 10. I went no huddle. And the clock went all the way down to zero, and I lost, so that's a tough loss. But we're going to get over it very, very soon. Uh, Legends come out uh, this weekend. You know, Call Football, of course, comes out this weekend, like I already said. So, you know, we're going over the Divine Diablo right here. You know, 86 speed. You know, we've already, we've already went over him. Super good card. Let's get back into live Nolan real quick. I finally finished the Season of Boom challenges, except one of them. The final challenge in the defensive Season of Boom is glitched. You have to uh, perform a hit stick or big tackle and not allow a touchdown in the fourth quarter. The thing is, I have gotten a hit stick and it said one of two. So yeah, I'm guessing you have to get two and I allowed a fourth quarter touchdown and the challenge didn't, didn't end. So it's very, very strange. But we ended up getting, uh, I think if we do the math, 57 stars except the 60. So we got an upgrade token for Najee Harris. We actually got a, two of them, I believe. Yeah, we got two of them. And then we have some packs. So let's get into the 78 plus. First, can we get a big pull? Maybe? No, we don't. But we get 82 overall Garrett Bradbury. So that's not terrible. Except we have the Jeff Saturday. So he'll be the starter for now. Let's actually go back and promote him to starter. And we actually already have a Garrett Bradbury. So never mind. Didn't know that. He's probably like a bench player. Let's go into the Stratagem. Can we get a green? That's what we're looking for. And we don't. We just get a bull rush right there. And daily coin pack. I got 10,000 coins last night just grinding. What do we get here? We get 4,000. We we've got 4,000 a lot. We're at 45. We're at 485k right now. So we're doing pretty good. Level 26, but hit level 27. I forgot to show you guys the objectives. We might be getting something uh right after this maybe do we get our naji do we have some more awards coming i think we do let's see what we have yep this is our naji hairs right here uh let's see yep there's naji this card is absolutely horrible he will not even be making the team uh even when upgraded this man is terrible he is so bad i'd only be doing i, I would only be upgrading him for the uh season of boom chemistry Let's actually just upgrade him right now. But he's not making the team. He'll be our third stringer just for the chem. Uh, but this card sucks. He has 81 speed fully upgraded. That is horrible. Not a good card at all. We have two unopened packs. I knew we had some packs. So we have a, this 76 plus. We, this can be sellable. So let's see what we get. Looks like it's going to be a, not a great card. And then we have a uh, 78 plus B and D right here. Hopefully, maybe an 85. Do we get something? We get 82 overall Zay Jones. <clears throat> I don't think he's going to make the team either. Especially because we have Christian Watson coming and Puka Nakua coming. That Puka Nakua is an 82 overall. Uh, but he does have better stats than this. So, Zay Jones will probably be quick sold or just staying on the... Staying in the item binder. But that's all we've done so far. We've done the challenges. Uh, we've... I guess we've worked on the season of boom stuff. Yeah, we're almost done with the force fumbles, which is actually insane. So we're passing touchdowns and challenges are all 15 stars and ultimate boom challenges. I don't know if that's hard or not. 
Uh, we'll have to look through that. A complete season of boom token sets. I think we're going to do that very, very soon. And then get team tackles with two plus season of boom players. Win games with two plus. We have, that's already a thing. And then that's there again. I don't know if there's going to be a part three. Likely not. But you can get all the way up here today. Uh, next episode will be dropping Saturday, I believe. Uh, Steelers franchise tomorrow. We're going to do a lot of no money spent. A lot of Steelers franchise. College football will be returning. I'm thinking of making a new channel for that, though. So I can do, like, prediction videos and everything. But let's see if we can do a set right here. And let's see. Yes, we can. So we can do a boom token exchange. Now, the thing with this one, it's actually kind of difficult of what to pick. So you, get, you can get a choice of a 78 plus, an 80 plus overall B&D player, or 34, 35 K coin quick sell. We can complete it three times. I don't know if we have enough tokens for a third time. Uh, but we're also going to get to another level in the season of Boom Pass, which is good. Which is a Boom Token Exchange. Oh, sorry. That is my fault. That's the pack we're getting right now. We're not going to go 35k. To be honest, the 78 plus might be our might might be good. Might it's either 35k or 78 plus. But if we want a chance, if we want a chance, something good, I think we go the 80 plus, and that's what we're going to do right now. You know, we can get 35k easy. And if we get an 85 out of here, you know, it's definitely worth it. Let's see what we get. Come on. We get 82 overall clash. You can't see. All right. So it's not an 80, but it's an 82. We already have him on the squad. So, you know, we're just going to quick sell him. Uh, we're going to quick sell every uh, card we don't need. Uh, do we get another chance at a boom token exchange pack? No, we've seen the M. So that'll be coming in the next episode. Uh, I don't think there's anything left to do. I did end up playing head-to-head -head ranked last night after I got the Divine Diablo. And, you know, don't talk about the first four games. Talk about the last two. I definitely felt locked in last night. You know, those first four games were trying to kind of just getting the placement. Uh, the, these last two games have been locking in. Uh, so, yeah, rank breakdown. If you don't know what this is, the higher the rank you are, the better card you get. I'm hoping to at least get, you know, elite. I'm hoping to just get elite, you know, hero and champion would be nice i don't know we're definitely not going to get top 100 at all but it would be pretty pretty fire if we could kyle pitts i would love to have that card and then going over the season one field pass we had new objectives coming in seventy-two thousand xp coming in the game absolutely insane so if we do the math we can get all the way up to level 30 today level 30 including also the week two so we can almost just finish out the field pass. So if we do the math, we do the math. We have done 6,000 right there, 12,500. We've only done 12,500. And then we have, it looks like, let me think. It looks like we have about 70K right here as well, which is insane. So we have 140K XP just sitting here. So we can get all the way up to level 32 today. That's insane. So what we can get, you know, season one player, 83 overall upgrade token, the season two XP token, which is huge. And then an epic options pack, you know, not as great as you think. And man, this has been an incredible series. Hopefully you enjoy this video. Episode two coming on Saturday, the start of college football. I know Georgia Tech, uh, Florida State first game. Uh, we got there's a new quarterback for Florida State. Georgia Tech looks pretty good. I'm excited to watch that one. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe to be a part of the Goat Cane. Do you guys want a new college football channel coming out tomorrow? Do you want it today? Uh, do you want me to do rebuilds with like Florida State? Do you want me to do a Florida State rebuild? The first rebuild of the channel? Or do you just want me to stick everything on this channel? Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe to be a part of the Goat Cane. Steelers franchise come tomorrow. And we'll see you in the next one. Peace.